My dear lords and ladies, the wait is over. The British are coming. Pick them up. Okay. Downton Abbey is back on the big screen. The modern world comes to Downton. And the Crawleys, Lord and Lady Grantham, Hugh Bonneville and Elizabeth McGovern, along with Lady Mary and Michelle Dockery, are about to say hello to Hollywood. I do hope that was a prop. Mary has that thing of kind of like rolling her eyes, but actually underneath she's she's secretly having quite a good time. And by the end, I think she, by that last, you know, moment where you see these guys in those amazing costumes and I think she's really loving it. And she's sort of showing off to the family. And spoiler alert, there's a tearful farewell. There is a big, big loss in this movie. What was that like for you as a cast? saying goodbye to such an integral part of Downton Abbey. I'm not going to talk about it. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's hard to talk about without... You without can't, yeah, I'm not, not going to spoil it for your audience. So, so let, let, Let's uh, suffice it to say that um, we've all worked together for so long that it's very easy to access a feeling of emotion about each other in general. And I personally, I never liked the character of Tom Branson, but there you go. <laughs> He's kidding, we think. That is where the mystery resides. But emotions on set were at an all-time high for whomever it may be. I mean, those, that particular scene, you know, those particular scenes you're talking about were very, you know, they're, they're, so, they're it's always such a challenge when there's a big change like that. And, you know, we've been doing the yeah. show for such a long time. And um, it was emotional. And sort of half the challenge is kind of keeping your own emotions at bay, you know. Mm. Um, a lot of us play characters who try not to show their emotions too much. So for me, yeah. it was like, yeah. you know, trying to hold it back as much as possible. But it was very moving. Mm. My character just wanted to make his movie. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah. <laughs> he just didn't, I don't know, he's wrapped the movie by that yeah, point. Whatever. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, he's like, come on, the guys, let's get out of here. Yep, Hugh Dancy plays the hotshot director who wants the castle and the staff like Joanne Froggett's Anna, Phyllis Logan's Mrs. Hughes, and Kevin Doyle's Mr. Mosley as his backdrop. To be a little bit of a flirtation with with, yeah, with somebody always. who may or may not be sitting to your right? Yeah, always. I mean, I think Mary always has some sort of... <laughs> Something some, on the some, go. Something dabbling. <laughs> cut! Cut! Sorry. It's, um, th this part of the storyline, at least, is about fame and the world of celebrities. And I know there are a lot of celebrities who are fans of Downton Abbey. Have there been any celebrities that have surprised you who are fans? I mean, you never know exactly what's true, but there was a story about Mick Jagger being a fan. Did you not hear that story? Oh, yeah, that they you? cut rehearsals short one day for a gig oh. because they were like, they always go watch Downton. I well, don't necessarily be believe that's, true, that's true, true, but, but it's a great I, story. So, you know, my, never let the truth get in the way of a great story. My big one is, and I think it's out the other day, Michelle Obama. Oh, uh, yeah. 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 And then we oh, met her. Oh. I did. I, I met, met her. her. Oh, you um, met Michelle? What? Yes. <gasps> what was that like? I know. Oh, she was just like a... I don't know, a goddess? A moving picture at Downton. Would you be open to making more Downton Abbey movies in the future? I would, yes. Yeah, because it's, it's, it, it's lovely to it's lovely to have everybody back together again, apart from anything else. Yeah. And it's so much of it is about the audience out there. You know, if this yeah. film does well and is received well and there's an appetite for another one, um, then, you know, I'd be really interested to see where Julian would take the next story. Well, why not? I mean, how many Fast and Furiouses have there been? I like what Hugh came up with the last time he was asked this question is, we've got Fast and Furious 6, so we'll do Slow and Stately 4. <laughs> <laughs> do sit down. Downton Abbey, a new era in theaters Friday. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.